Welcome everyone. In this video, I'll be showing you the best executor for Roblox on PC, Velocity Executor. Make sure to watch the video till the end to learn how to get the latest version. First, we need the Velocity Executor file. To get it, go to the comments section. You'll find a pinned comment with all the download links. There you'll find the download link for Velocity Executor the link to get the Reds Hub script for Blox Fruits, and a link to a tutorial on how to bypass the link shortener and download the file. If you don't know how to download the file, I highly recommend watching the tutorial. Now, let's see how we can install Velocity Executor. There are a few essential steps you need to follow to make sure Velocity Executor works properly without any issues. First, you need to disable a setting called Core Isolation. To do this, click on the Windows Security icon. Then, go to the Device Security section. Click on Core Isolation Details. Disable the first option you see there. Once you disable it, your PC will ask you to restart. Go ahead and restart your device. This step is very important to avoid any issues when injecting into Roblox. The second step is also crucial. You need to completely disable your device's real-time protection. Make sure that all protection settings are turned off during the installation and setup process. Don't worry, everything is completely safe. But simply, if you feel that it's not safe or you're unsure, then don't install it. Now, extract the compressed file. Inside, you'll find another compressed folder named Fixes. It contains some essential programs that must be installed on your system for Velocity Executor to work properly. Make sure all of them are installed. You'll also see the Velocity Executor icon. Next, you need to check your Roblox version. It must match the version shown on the screen. Once confirmed, open Roblox and log into your account. The developer of Velocity Executor recommends using an alternate account for now. Then, launch Blocks Fruits or your chosen game. Now, open Velocity Executor. It's time to start the injection process. Click on the monitor icon, then select the client. After that, click Inject. Wait a few moments until you see the message. Velocity Executor is ready. Now, paste your script code. For example, I'll be using Reds Hub. Paste the code and then click Execute. As you can see, everything is working perfectly. If you've made it this far in the video, 
Don't forget to support it by leaving a like and subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching.